Hello fish fools, Jeff here. So I just received a package and I'm gonna do an unboxing video here. And while I do that, I have my six foot 84 gallon community display tank in the background. So I just re recently placed an order with Super Cichlids. And I should mention, I am not sponsored by Super Cichlids. I don't have any product sponsorships. Along the way, on this channel, I have done many unboxing videos and I have no sp sponsorships with any of them. I should mention that. Um, I'm just a hobbyist and I, I want to share all the products and things that I use in my aquarium hobby. So um, in this box is, in my opinion, the best food for breeding Corridors. So in this tank, I have emerald green corridors, and they have bred several times. And yeah, so this package is inside a box, extreme aquatic foods, but that is not the best food for breeding. Corridor is that I mentioned, but we'll see what's inside and we'll find out what that is. All right, here we go. Here's just a note from Super Cichlids. Thank you so much, my friend. Happy New Year. And here are some on the side, looks like free samples. Super Cichlids is known to offer free samples. And this is just something else that I bought when I was just browsing their website knowing I was gonna order this food. And these are just a few intake sponges. I wasn't, um, Quite sure of the size, just in the scale size. These are pretty small, but I thought I would make use of them. I use intake sponges on all my hang on back filters, so here's some I have there. And this is significantly smaller than that, but I just thought I'd get it for the hell of it. Alright. And so let's see if this is sealed up. It is. I I didn't think I'd have to, yeah. All right, I'm gonna have to pause this for a moment and cut this open. Okay, so it wasn't sealed, but I did get it, you know, they just use it for the, the padding. So I just took it out of this. All right, so let's see what it is. If you're familiar with this channel, you might not, not be surprised that it is Rapashi Superfood. So this is grub pie. Um, they have different variations. This is the one I've been using the last several years. So this is a large, the largest size. This is 4.4 pounds. And this is the third time I've bought a 4.4 pounder. And my current supply is very close to the end, so I was going to need some more. All right, so this, um, the last couple times I bought, I was just curious. I looked up my order history on Super Cichlids, and the last one I bought was a little less than two years ago, and that still hasn't expired. That one. Um, is it set to expire in July? So it was still good. Before that, I it was about two years um, that a 4.4 lasted for me. Um, so this is the third 4.4 option. The first time I ever tried Rapashi was a 12 ounce, and it, what I got then was um, Community Plus. You know, I designed for I guess community fish, and this. Just having a live bearer on the 
in the picture, and I believe that's a Xiphophorus Xiphidium, a rare live bearer, um, similar to sword tails in here. This is Xiphophorus hilari, same genus, different species. Well, anyway, um, if I could ever get my hands on one of these, at some point I'd like to get some live, some rare live bears. If I could get something like this, that'd be so awesome. But anyway, um, live bearers love it, and I've found that corridors love it. I have corridors, different species and different tanks, and they have been breeding, and who knows, maybe a lot more that I don't even see. But yeah, so, now that I have a lot more aquariums and a lot more fish, I should go through it sooner, but now this is a little bit of a concern. Well, that's about a year. So where it has taken me about two years or so to go through 4.4 pounds, this time I have half the time, but yeah, I still should go through this in a year. Um, it is kind of pricey, it's a little expensive. This is, it's now $120 for 4.4 pounds. Like, Previous two times I bought it, it was $100, um, but it's a good value considering the size and going you know, as much as I'm going to feed it. And now that I've had more success with spawning corridors and realizing this is a big reason for that, I intend to use it more. Um, so, all right, that is for Apache Superfood. Red pie. Let's see what else we got. So we got all the, the free stuff in here. So with every order, I don't know if there's like a, a cost minimum, I forget, but there is, well, for free shipping. Free shipping over $50? Okay, right here. Free gift over $70. So this bottle of Seachem Prime was free with uh, my order. And then, in this, in here is all the free samples, different fish food samples. And one little thing that they do, and they have done in the past, the previous times I ordered from Super Cichlids, they add this little, little candy, Swedish fish, that's a nice little, a nice little thing that they do. All right. Here is Extreme Community Crave Flake Food. Dr. Basilier. Matron, Matrine. Sinking Food, Extra Extra Large. Yeah, these are, well, maybe some of my bigger fish can eat that. This tank does have, is home to some of my bigger fish, like the roseline sharks and some of the, and the pearl garami. Some of those scissor tail rasbors are about maybe five inches. All right, and here's extreme. Just some kind of pellet food. Extreme scrapers, some wafers. Extreme fish food monster. Be oh, <laughs> I'll have to crumble these down. I don't have monsterish, and this is looks like the same thing from Dr. Besslier, just a smaller size. Than the previous one. All right, that's everything in here. So, yeah. So as I mentioned, it was pretty recently the last time that my corridor spawned. So while we're at it, let's see an example of some. I got some babies. So in this. Breeder box, there is some corridors fry. There was a 
a little over a week ago that they hatched out. And there's about 20 or so in here. I collected the eggs and put them in here. Um, so far, still about 20. In the past, I've done this. The suction gets unsuctioned and I've lost some of them and I'm in, and I do intend to set up a separate tank just for corridors for I have to collect the eggs and move them to. But, I haven't, don't have that ready, so I have some in here, so let's check some out. So here we go, I can see some week old or a little over week old corridors fry in here. And I do believe that Rapashi Superfood is a huge factor in their existence. All right, well, that's it for now. And remember, I'm Jeff, and I enjoy fishies. Thanks for watching.